She just wants to be beautiful. She goes unnoticed. She knows. YouTube, it's Takisa, and I'm back with a new video. And in this video, I'll just be showing you guys everything that I've accumulated over the past month or so. And yeah, so let's get into the video. So the first thing that I picked up was the Shine Free Oil Control Loose Powder from Maybelline New York. And this is a powder that I heard about from a couple of people. And they said that this powder is really slept on and everybody keeps buying you know a lot of expensive powders um so i wanted to see what the hype was about and i got it in the shade medium and the next product i got from my local beauty supply store and this is the la girl pro coverage high definition longwear illuminating foundation and this is definitely not my shade um i am definitely in the shade <laughs> I'm definitely in the shade toast I got rich cocoa because in the store I guess the lighting was different and it looked like my shade and I you know put it against my hand and you know it looked perfect but once I put it on my face I realized that it wasn't and so I have to go back and get a new one the next product that I got is the black radiance color perfect HD uh, HD mousse foundation and I got it in the color toffee and this is how it looks and I used this before and I actually love it it feels like I'm just putting on you know another layer of skin because it's so perfect I, I just love it and I actually use this on my mom um, not this one but her shade of course and she is in love with this so this is something that you guys should definitely invest in it's only like ten dollars and i got it from walgreens the next foundation that i picked up from uh, walgreens is the maybelline superstay better skin foundation in the shade coconut and i don't know if you guys can see it but yeah um in the shade coconut and someone that i know that does makeup as well she um use this and we're kind of like the same shade and so i was like let me just go pick it up and this is actually the darkest color that they have so i was glad that i was able to you you know pick this up and see what it's about and i actually tested it out and i liked it so i will be using that in my future tutorials and i picked up the the concealer to go with it but I think it might be too light for me. So I'm just going to go and see if Walgreens will let me switch it out. Because it's not open yet. So yeah, but I got it in medium deep. The next concealer that I got is um, the Absolute New York Radiant Cover um, Concealer in the shade Dark Warm. And this was a perfect... Um, a perfect concealer and this was only like five dollars and I'm just gonna swatch it for you guys so you can see and it goes on so smooth like super smooth and I like it it's not like super duper full coverage but it's buildable and I, I like that about concealers because I don't want something super thick when I you know take it out of the package the next concealers that I got are from Wet n Wild and I was super surprised on how amazing like amazing these concealers were and um, I got their um, photo focus concealer photo focus concealer sorry <laughs> photo focus concealer in dark cocoa and medium deep tan and I got two because I wasn't sure um, which one would you know match me because in the store the lighting is definitely different so um, I'm definitely gonna be putting the lighter one in my kit for my more fair skin um, clients and then this one I will definitely keep for myself and they're very nice and full coverage and they glide on like a dream so I definitely recommend that um, they're only like five dollars and I think it's worth it. Next products that I got are from Wet n Wild as well. 
and I got three of their cat liquid cat suit liquid um matte lipsticks and I got them in the shade give me mocha and this is a pretty like mauvey pink and yeah this is like something I will wear every day that's that's how it looks like that and the next one is goth topic um this is something that i will wear like if i'm going out or something like that i don't wear a lot of dark shades every day i like nudes and stuff like that but that's how it looks and it's really really pretty um and the next color is flame of the game and this is the orange um if you guys do follow me on instagram then you know that i do like colorful looks and stuff like that and i'll just you know post something really different and so i didn't have an orange um lipstick like this it's more reddish than orange um and i like that about it so i picked it up and these were three for ten actually so i got three for ten dollars and that's a very good price the next product that i got from wet and wild is their pressed powder um in the color cocoa and i use this for an all over powder and it's so bomb like i honestly love that wet and wild like did their thing i'm so proud of them like wet and wild if you need me to be a pr you know my email is in my uh, description box i got you the next thing that i got is from milani i got their uh more matte lip cream in the color adorable and um i love the packaging on all the milani stuff um, it's so classy even for it to be like a drugstore product packaging is bomb and that is the color right there the end color and i would you know line this with the brown liner and just you know top that off with that and i like it i think i replaced my adorable because i dropped my other one when i was doing the client and it broke and she was like i'll keep it if you don't want to keep it in your kit and i was like okay so i finally found adorable because it was always sold out and i picked it up the next product that i got is the 24 hour edge tamer from ebon i believe yeah ebon new york and it's just a small one because i wanted to try it since i do have naturally curly hair i don't use a lot of edge controls because it does not hold my hair down at all and i freaking hate that because i don't really like using gel in my hair um just because it's hard and it's you know it takes all your edges so i um, i'm going to try this and see how i like it and if i like it then i'll go buy the full size but this was like two dollars for a mini one and you don't have to use a whole bunch so i think it's worth it and the next product i got is the elf blending sponge it's so bright the elf blending sponge and it's like this peachy color and I'm not 100% sure that I might like this. It just looks like one of those drugstore sponges. Like, I don't want to open it yet, but I might do it and give it away or something like that. But it is hard, kind of. Like, you can tell through the packaging that it's kind of hard. But I don't know how to feel when I, you know, wet it. Um, So, we'll just see. I'll probably buy two. Um, I do want to do a giveaway when I reach my first 100 subscribers so you guys look out for that the next thing i got from elf is the aqua beauty molten liquid um eyeshadow in the color rose gold i think i think i took it out and put it backwards so excuse me i'm gonna take this out and then show you guys and the packaging on their new stuff is freaking bomb like elf is definitely doing a dumb doing the thing like for real they not playing they did not come to play honey okay and i'm just gonna put it under the lipsticks 
and it doesn't look like a rose gold it looks like a pinky like a pinky silver but I don't know maybe I'll use it in a tutorial or something with like some of my pinks or something from um, my Morphe palette but we'll see how it looks when I you know use it the next thing that I got is of course my miracle my miracle blending sponge from um real techniques and i lost my other one i don't know where i put it i did go out of town so i might have lost it there and yeah so i always have to have one of these like i use this on my clients i use this on me i use this what is that in my video a piece of lint great um so yeah i had to i always read up on these i definitely get the double packs when i'm doing clients and stuff so i just bought one for me because the stuff in my kit i don't use on myself yeah and the next products i am very very proud of like i thought these were going to fail me and they didn't they actually came through and they showed out and they're from Mark Anthony True Professional. I got their uh, curl cream and it eliminates frizz and defines curls with extra hold and add shine. And I got their coconut oil. Um, and these two came together in a bundle deal. Um, I was two for ten, and these are dumb expensive at Walgreens. Like, if you go to the beauty aisle where the hair stuff is like this is like $13 by itself and then this is like $12 so I was glad to get these for only $10 and the curl cream is bomb I have it in my hair right now this is actually two days old and I haven't added anything to it I just put my hair up um, and the coconut oil I use for my body my face everything like I use it to take off my makeup and I use this after I get out of the shower so um, I've been loving this coconut oil. I do use different coconut oils to see the difference and see if they, you know, are, you know, man-made or 100% coconut oil. So, um, I'm very proud of these products and I will be buying more when they're on sale because these are expensive and I am on a budget. The next products that I bought are from soft and free and i do protein treatments maybe once every two months because you know washing hair does strip your hair sometimes and it strips it of the protein that it needs so i'll do like a deep conditioning with the protein packets and this is their milk and milk protein and olive oil really deep conditioning treatment and it stops breakage and promotes growth so um, I do recommend you guys get these because these work bomb and they're only 97 cents at Walmart you can't beat that like you cannot beat this at all the next product that I got <clears throat> excuse me sorry it's allergy season y'all so I, I feel like I'm sick but I'm not sick and yeah my voice I sound like a man oh well and <clears throat> The next product that I got is the Eco Styler Gel in the travel size. And I had to get two of these because when I went to Puerto Rico, they threw away my gel when I was coming back to Florida. And I was so pissed because I spent $4 on a freaking gel when at home it's like $2.99. I was so bad. So, you know, I got the travel size. So when I go on my next trip, I have, you know, my Eco Styler gel with me and they won't throw it away because it's under four ounces. So, yeah, and this is the only kind that I use. I'll get the green kind just if they don't have the big, the big size of this one. But, um, I don't use any other kind but the Argan Oil kind because the olive oil one flakes on my hair. I don't know why, but it does. And last but not least, I picked up some body washes from Soft Soap, I believe, yeah, Soft Soap. And this is their Luminous Oils 
um, body wash in macadamia oil and peony and I got it in avocado oil and iris as well um, these were buy one get one free at Walgreens and they're $3.99 each so I bought like six of them and I gave two away to my best friend and yeah so those are the two kinds that I have in the luminous oil and in their body butter um, shea and almond oil and this smells so so amazing like oh my gosh you guys this is a dream that is the end of my video there's another piece of lint and there it goes but um yeah <laughs> you guys thank you for watching and comment down below what you guys want to see next i would love to um do something different if you guys want to <clears throat> if you guys want to see something let me know if you guys um, have any requests or any questions be sure to leave it down in my comments and I do respond um, in a timely manner of course thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video